what are my final thoughts on a four core cpu gaming in 2021 what's your budget it always comes down to budget dude yeah linus linus has autobots that scour youtube and anything that even remotely sounds like his voice gets dmca'd right away right away the scores are way off my 5800x is 15,000 multi stock or all core overclock i genuinely don't know i've never run cinebench r23 so why is this 300 multi-core what is this why does it say 300 here and not like 10,000 or whatever is this is, did he did he mean single core maybe what I don't understand so he he just used uh completely arbitrary numbers for the bottom scale like point like point equals better what the fuck you kind of have to go by percentage then wouldn't you so it would be like uh it would be like let's say 300 5800x and what's the uh, maybe 165 once divided by 165 81% faster? That's possible. Eighty-one percent faster? No, yeah, it would be more than double faster, then wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah, it would be, wouldn't it? Yeah, fifteen hundred X would be more than double. Right. Yeah, yeah, that's true. So it is that is kind of fucked up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I mean, it sure it differs. Board heavy, we end up spending a lot of money for something. Cinebench R23 single thread web browser. Oh, there it is. Rent Cinebench R23. Oh, single core. Oh, it's just points equals higher. Thread, what the fuck? Web browsing, Grand Theft Auto 5, and. Dude, I. Hot take. I see nothing wrong with this. Did he say the 4770K was stock? Screen Valhalla results? You'd be hard pressed to guess which CPU is in it. The 3300X, which represents a. Wow, look at that. I mean. Yeah, okay. So. Back when I was a small channel on the Ye Times of Yore. Ye times of yore. Um, we're going way back, baby. Mm -hmm. We're going. We're going even further back than this. Holy shit! Thirty-three hundred X versus forty-seven ninety K. Seven hundred views. One of my very first videos, dude. One of my very first ones. We are <laughs> oh, that's sexy this guy is oh my god my video quality has gotten so much better this is wild to go back and watch now oh my god dude this is embarrassing to watch it's fucking crazy dude it's crazy yeah i remember so this is what i had the 4790k at 4.8 gigahertz 43 ring 2400 mam right the latency still seems kind of high but anyway fire strike physics not too far off right i remember this dude i was like the 4790k is the goat processor 
just gotta overclock it to the fucking tits. Literally like 200 points off. Strange Brigade. 4790k is literally 20 FPS behind a 3300x. 3970x is the old Sandy Bridge um, HDT one, right? Dude, they're not like I don't see anything wrong with uh, Linus's numbers. The Cinebench is kind of fucked, but but the FPS in games is not as. I mean, does he say what RAM he runs on them? Right? Maybe he's running like maybe he's running 2400C9 on the on the Haswell and running 3200C16 on the fucking Ryzen one, right? Right? Let's see the next one. Fortnite FPS. This one's 100 FPS behind. It's like 500 FPS. Yeah, dude, there's nothing wrong. I don't see anything wrong with those numbers. Oh, yeah. Overwatch when it had a fucking cap, right? PUBG. 20 FPS behind. Yeah, dude. Shadow of the Tomb Raider FPS. 7 FPS behind a 3300X. His numbers were okay, dude. Warzone FPS, literally 4 FPS behind a 33. Oh no, it actually beat the 3300X. Right, I remember that, dude. That was fucking funny. I remember that. All right, guys, those are the results. Dude, nothing wrong with that. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I think maybe, uh, I think maybe hardware elitism has maybe made people blind a little bit, right? But that video, man, I released that shit one of my very first videos when I overclocked both of those four core CPUs to the tits. Yeah, dude. What are my final thoughts on a four core CPU gaming in 2021? What's your budget? It always comes down to budget, dude. Didn't Linus say that if you had a hundred dollars and that's all you had? Well, then you don't really have a choice, right? Beggars can't be choosers. Would I, but would I play with one? No, obviously not, dude, because they, they suck at single player games. But you can't just be like, four core CPU suck. I'm like, well, dude, that's like the majority of the planet, right? Like, like that's like everybody still has a four core CPU, dude. All right. Let's see here. with hyper threading yeah that's a good point um see if he tested a sandy bridge that would have been a much different story because it doesn't have avx but haswell and devil's canyon has avx so that's fine these are all like weird fucking simpy comments though yeah in terms of his benchmarks i would just just ignore the cinebench ones that's really weird but the gaming ones look okay i suppose right they kind of line up with mine mine was overclocked to the tits but they don't they're not too far off of what my numbers were right back like a year ago or whatever i could probably overclock that 3300x further now that i have a little bit more knowledge and now that there's more updated updated agisas and shit, right so you can't really go back to my numbers from back then with old motherboard Agisa BIOS versions now, but now, or like by back then, yeah, I would say so. I don't see it really too much of a problem with that, right? Um, I look better too. What in the old one or the new one? God damn it! Wait, don't answer that. Don't ask. Don't. I don't want to ask questions. I don't want to know the answers to, dude. God damn it. Uh.
Uh, let me catch up here. Yeah, I would just ignore the weird Cinebench numbers, dude, because he doesn't use the actual score for the scale. He uses an arbitrary percentage scale. That could fucking mean anything, dude. It could actually just be legit, but you have no idea because it's an arbitrary number. All he wanted to show was the bar being bigger, not the actual number. It's super weird. It's just a weird way. Of Again, good enough is subjective, right? Good enough is a four core CPU with or is a four core CPU good enough for streaming? What the fuck? Twitch. Let's go down to like what's a what's a game somebody could stream with four core? Overwatch. Let's go all the way to the bottom of the list where nobody's watching. Some one that one viewer Andy. Who fucking knows, dude? Webcam? Sure. Let's see what this guy's up to. The dude the dude has 50 FPS. Six he has a locked 60 FPS. He's streaming. Is it good enough? I don't know. You tell me. Right? The guy has 60 FPS. He's probably in bronze. Can't kill shit. But he's streaming. Right? Is it good enough? I, I guess so. It can do it. Is it good enough for a high quality stream? No. But yeah, that's what I mean. It's... It, it, everything on the internet can get boiled down to definition of words right everything dude 